They are no good. Don't go towards them. You're going to lose a lot of money. They don't want someone taking some type of action or making some type of decision. So they're trying to keep this person juggling. But someone already knows the truth about their future if they take that action. Listen, this is your emperor these people are playing with. And this man got a lot of feelings for you. So it, right now, he's like, that's for the birds. All that nonsense they're saying, he said, uh, that's for the birds. I know it's the truth. <laughs> You you know that situation where someone is telling you something and you already know the truth and you just sit there and listen to them for entertainment purposes and you say, mm-hmm, yep, my goodness, yep, mm-hmm. Yeah, it's something like that. There's a woman sending her friend in because this man already knows the truth. I'm telling you, he knows the truth about who you are. This connection, whatever this is, he knows the truth. There's a woman in a community because a man, a masculine, an emperor won't, don't want to talk to her anymore, she's sending her friends in to talk to this masculine, to talk him out of taking some type of action. But I'm telling you, this man knows the truth, so he will be communicating with you. <laughs> oh, he knows the truth. Something has been revealed to this man about what will happen if he connects with you. It will be successful. It will be successful. And this is keeping a group of people way down behind the scenes. It's an empress energy that's way down. She's burning and barely holding on. It's like, don't go. Don't go to her. She's not an empress. She's karmic. And he said, uh, lies. Um, uh, lies. She don't know nothing. I'm the real empress. Uh, lies. You're telling more lies. You're telling more lies. I'm out. <laughs> she said, I'm out. out. <laughs> Leaving them out in the cold. <sighs> it's a group of people about to be pissed off with this message when it comes out. It said, why is she laughing? This is our life on the line here. We don't give two hits. Your life is on the line. You should have thought twice. before. You see that those two swords right there? You had the opportunity to think twice before you took some type of action <laughs> to cause someone ending the whole time they were protected. Okay? <laughs> Try to block someone's hope. They don't want you being hopeful. Someone does not want you being optimistic in life. They want to put an end to it. They say, you cannot be optimistic. We blocked opportunities for you. We got people to reject you. You are alone. Why are you happy? You're like, who told you I was alone? <laughs> it's 9 billion people on the planet. You really think a group of karmics rejecting a light worker is going to have that light worker in some type of depression? This is the reason why every plan you come up with is a dumb, dumb, dumb one. It don't go nowhere. You really thought that someone was going to be like, I got to hold back from everybody. <laughs> Everyone is a disappointment. I've invested and I've invested. I've been nice to everybody. I give, 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 and I just don't get anything back in return. I got to keep away. Meanwhile, someone's out here working at our, walking out here with confidence. Like, hmm. you, you people can kick rocks and throw peppers for all we care. We don't care. <laughs> and it's causing a tower. Because this, this collaboration is still coming together. Someone will be spoiling you and it's going to piss people off. This is like one of the... <laughs> let's see. Someone will be committing to you because they know who you are on a spiritual level. Listen, someone out there, your emperor is petty. Petty, he is petty. Someone is about to be putting you front and center so that these people can know exactly what he's doing for you. <laughs> how happy you are, how happy he is. Your emperor is petty. Honey, when I said this man is about to have you front and center, he can't miss it. He said, you see her? I know you see her. You see her. <laughs> that lets me know, Collective, you have a petty bone to you too. 
Because this man is petty. He wants to put you front and center. So every time those comics turn on the TV screen, every time they turn YouTube on, every time they turn on TikTok, Instagram, whatever else, they see you front and center, happy as can be, wearing the best of the best, smiling. Man, bam, you got a petty emperor on your arm. Oh, you got a petty one and he don't care. That man don't care at all. At all. <laughs> he about to be out here like, he's about to be out here like, you see her? Yeah, I know you see her. You see her? Yeah, I know you see her. That's mine right there. <laughs> Ooh, these comments are about to be mad, mad. Mad, mad. They said, why ain't she pissed up? We got this person to give an offer to someone else. Oh, and that's because this person knows their future. They know who they are. You are so small-minded. Why are you this invested in destroying someone, blocking someone's life, forward movement, balance, and everything? Trying to defeat a king of swords. That could be whoever your emperor is could be in his king of swords energy. And someone has a higher knowing that these people don't even know. And this is why everything they tell him... He got his back turned to them. He said, mm-mm, Linda. No, 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 no. I'm still moving forward to invest in my future. And it's weighing them down. He said, we don't told him. This man knows the truth, honey. You're talking to someone that's spiritually gifted. And that's something an emperor doesn't tell people. They don't know that this man is spiritually. This could be like a higher fence. That they're trying to manipulate. But he knows. Deep down a masculine knows. An emperor knows who he's going towards is just as gifted as he is. And these two. You two may have some type of calling in spirituality. Healing people. Getting people to live in their truth. That he knows you are a true empress. And there's a fake empress behind the scenes that's way down. Way down. She thought she was going to destroy you and keep pretending to be. This is like a woman. I don't know if this is someone's wife, someone's mother. I don't know what this is. Pretending like she had calmed down. She had changed. She had healed. This woman didn't heal in no way, shape, or form. Someone was basically out here pretending to be healed, but still taking impulsive actions behind the scenes to end someone else's livelihood, stability, work against someone, block someone. This is what she's been doing behind the scenes the whole time. And if you didn't know, now you'll know the truth, sir. A sister was never working on healing. She's always been bothered. She's like the plague. This is her natural state. This is her natural state. These are the two energies you're in between. You're in between death and life. Someone pouring into you and someone just dead in your, your, your destiny. It said, I want to go start this business. I don't think it's going to work out. Ain't nobody doing that. Ain't nobody heard of that before. Why, why would you want to do that? Let's look into it. Let's find out everything we need to find out so we can know how to approach this the right way. Right? <laughs> Lord have mercy. There's a woman behind the scenes. That has been copying another woman. She pretends that she doesn't stalk someone. She's been stalking someone. And them ancestors have been watching her the whole time. They say, you know what? This is one of those situations. You know someone is copying you. Trying to dead your life, your pathway. And your ancestors tell you, hey, hon. hon stay calm. We need her to seal her fate. So it may take a while for him to see the truth. It may take a while for them to see the truth. But we need you to stay calm. Lay low. Yeah, we know you see what they're doing. We know, we know, we know. We know she's stealing from you, pretending to be you. We need you to hush and let her keep going. Okay? Okay. When the time comes, we're going to take action and expose her for exactly who she is. Okay? Hush. They told you to hush. They said reconsider your actions. Don't take any impulsive actions out here. We got this. They said we got this. Focus on your dreams, okay? Sister been working with a whole karmic out here to cause you endings, a whole king of cups. She's been working with a king of cups. I don't know if this is someone that you used to date or there's someone that presents themselves to be a king of cups. But anyways, your ancestors sister, told you, hush now. 
hush now, little child. We got this. And someone kept going and going, pretending to be you, pretending to be you, pretending to be multifaceted. And now they can't pretend anymore. And this masculine have, has been there saying, oh, you're not getting any better. You thought you told me you were healing. You told me you were working on yourself. You told me you were this. You've been doing nothing but telling lies, manipulating. You ain't healed. You're not improving. Because <laughs> the sister, this is all she knows. This is all she knows. <laughs> how to manipulate. How to gaslight. How to cause stalemate. Been causing stalemate in your life. The entire relationship. You don't even know. If someone is into voodoo, he do, she do. They do, quote, do, we don't do. Over here, over there, in the other collective's lean. In collective veil, we don't do cook, do because what uh, we get everything we need from source. We are always replenished. We're always filled. A cup runneth over with joy, blessings, abundance. Okay, and this is why people always want to defeat us. They said we gotta take charge of their life. I'm gonna take action to cause manipulation. I'm gonna tell a lot of lies. Okay. Going to cause a lot of havoc in their life. I'm going to work with their family members, friends, and everything. So he knows she's not a true empress. There is something where between two groups, a woman pretended to be an empress for so well, so long. I don't know why I just said for so well. She pretended to be an empress so long and so well. One group actually told the group that had the actual empress that we got the real empress over here. I don't know what you're talking about. That's not a real empress over there. The whole time, the fake empress was behind the scenes causing endings for the true empress. Okay. So this is like you not paying people. You, you may not even know who this woman is. Mind you, let's put that out there. You may not even know who this woman is, but she got her eyes set on you. I don't know if she found out a masculine was interested in working with you, being with you, or he found out you were his soul twin and she wanted to prove that you and him, that she and him were soul twin and that you and him were not soul twins. So a sister started copying your personality. I mean, she was working him, watching you every day even have family members and friends watching you and she used every information she found out to cause illusions about this connection okay she said no 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 no. that is not the true empress i'm the true empress your ancestor says lies we're gonna need you to sit down somewhere okay i'm the true empress meanwhile she got a whole group of people to collaborate with her to cause you endings so a man, a masculine, could see her as the true empress. And now all of the illusions have come to an end. She don't know what to do. You're not around anymore for someone to copy. So she's way down. Don't know which way she's going. Out here like a chicken with his head cut off. So, have you, where's the empress? Where's the empress? I need to watch the empress so that I can pretend to be her. I can't pretend to be the empress if I'm not watching the empress anymore. Where's the empress? Out here like a chicken with his head cut off. Don't got no direction. Now that the truth is out. Oh yeah, the truth is out. And this masculine knows the truth about this empress. Right? Oh, he's trying to leave the karmic behind. He said, wait, 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 wait. You mean to tell me this whole time? That's the empress? Oh. Oh. A brother's about to dip. I don't know whose story this is. I'm sorry. I got to have some humor to it. A brother's about to dip. He said, oh, 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 I've got to get out of here. I know exactly what's going on. You've been manipulating me, and I'm taking my power back. Headed in the direction that I want to. This is someone's wife that's been collaborating with a group of people, even a freaking high priestess, to block an empress energy. Okay? This is a whole wife that's been causing blockages. And she's caused so many blockages that her money is looking funny now. Either this is a wife, a mother character, or someone that's like a counterpart to this masculine, whoever this is. It's a queen of pentacles going through some type of ending behind the scenes. Her money's looking funny. She don't pay. 
so many people to cause you blockages. Oh yeah, she's been paying a king of cups and a king of swords uh -huh. <laughs> to cause stagnations in your life. A whole group is fighting behind the scenes, living in fear because they don't know what the heck is about to happen. But honey, it's the end of the road for you all. The rituals aren't working. Ain't nothing working, but they're still going to go back to the drawing board, come up with new plans on how they can end you, and they're always going to be disappointed. Disappointment. Disappointment. It's a disappointment. Now, for a star C out there, you have a couple of masculines or a few masculines that went from wanting to destroy you. Now they want to have victory with you because they see the truth about you. So they want to balance something out in your life. But a lot of them are afraid that you may not see them how they want you to see them. So they're falling and they can't get up because of what they invested in with a queen of wands. There could be a queen of wands in a community that has some type of situation she's been passing on to other people. So you may, you all may want to be mindful. You may want to be mindful. You may want to keep your distance from this woman. Someone comes in and asks that you, she, you are the center of her world. She's abundant. She's all kinds of stuff. And as soon as you lay, lay with her, she hits the target. You say, well, he got it now. He got it now. So, anyways. There's someone coming towards you that wants to work with you. They want you to know. Yeah, I'm telling you. This woman, this queen of pentacles, it ain't looking too well. There could be a couple out here, queen of pentacles, king of pentacles, that were working together to end you. They're going through some type of ending behind the scenes, but they're trying to keep it on a hush-hush. They don't have to be married, maybe just been together for a long time. Someone paid both of them to do you something, reject you, cause you some type of ending, block you. They're going through some type of ending behind the scenes, maybe trying to keep it on the hush-hush. But you know your ancestors don't be hiding nothing. Someone has lost their protection behind the scenes. Trying to stand their ground. Can't. Nah. Someone is being exposed for exactly who they are. Imbalance. Unhealed. Okay. A fake. A false. Nobody wants to work with them. Right. Dealing with a lot of addictions. You see the cars around this woman. Five of Pentacles. Temperance in reverse. Someone is exposed for who she is. She's exposed. Can't hide it no more. You know that thing where someone mask falls off and they want to put it back on. You say, you don't see me. You didn't see me. You saw nothing. And that emperor said, oh, uh, yeah, I, I saw that. I saw that. You're going to have to put your hand down. Take that mask off. I saw that. I saw that. Someone does not want to work with this woman anymore. And he's holding back from her because he knows the truth. He knows the truth. He's holding back. He said, uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. No, 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 no. I'm keeping my offer. Because a woman has been out here pretending to be business savvy, having it together. She don't got nothing together. Don't know what she's doing. A sister is an empty vessel walking about the face of the earth. And all she does is what cause illusions. Someone's very impulsive. And someone's uneasy behind the scenes. Very uneasy. Yeah, I'm telling you, very uneasy behind the scenes because you're going to be receiving some type of offer from someone wealthy. Like he's decided that he wants to work with you and someone finds you to be very beautiful and it's causing this woman distress behind the scenes. She's in distress. No, she's not beautiful. But deep down, she wants to be like you. <laughs> oh, my sister, please. I don't tire. Do not vex me. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Don't vex me. Someone does not like your beauty, but they want to be as beautiful as you. Someone does not like your youth, but they want to be as youthful as you. Someone does not like your gifts, but they want to have your gifts and abilities. If you're someone that's a practitioner, you don't got to be on social media like my silly stuff here. Someone just does not like you because you are you and they cannot be you. You make That makes sense? Okay. <laughs> Uh, it's like, no, I want to be her, but I hate her. I don't want to be like me anymore because I'm a facade. <laughs> I don't got nothing going on. Everything around me, around me dies. I got to steal from other people to thrive in life. But that empress right there, she's naturally abundant. And because I don't stand 
gonna cheers. I'm gonna try to block her new bikini, block love, block any type of balance from being brought into her life, block her bounty, block any offers. Black this emperor from coming towards her. And that emperor said, uh, girl, darling, I don't know who you're about to block from taking action, but, um, hello, hello, empress. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know we haven't talked in a while, but, um, I just wanted to see if you and you wanted to like go hang out or something like that. Yeah. He's going to be sending a message to someone, ma'am. We don't know what to tell you, but uh, rude awakening. The emperor will be communicating. Like this man, this ain't a, this is not a normal emperor. I don't know why that came out, but but honey, there is something you don't know about this emperor that's coming towards you. Okay, oh honey, you don't know. Be on the lookout. Everybody is burdened. Everybody is burdened. Yeah, because the truth is out. Mmm. Mmm. Dang. Mmm. A sister's business is out here. Dang. Front and center. All her business is just out there. The lies. The tricks. Like someone knows there's a feminine energy around him that does nothing but lie, manipulate, and gaslight. She ain't about nothing. She don't know nothing. That's what I'm... <laughs> I think that's what that emperor is saying. She don't know nothing. Nothing. <laughs> he said, what have I done to myself? Someone could have left a company, left a environment, something like that. And he's moving on with his life. I don't know what this is, honey. I got to hurry and get up here because my four-year-old boss is out there acting a while, uh, 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 acting a mess. So I got to go get on mommy duty. <laughs> but whoever this woman is, baby, he, she is. Her business is out front and center. Try to steal from someone. Try to block someone's forward movement. Try to steal some type of offer. I, like this woman hates the fight. She hates the fact that you are like optimistic, hopeful. You look on the brighter side of things. You're very balanced in life, right? You have a healing energy. You're loving. When things don't go the way you think they should go, you take a new path. You see things from a higher perspective and you're always working on yourself. That's something you work on yourself to bring balance into your situation. Like you're not staying up late at night burdened about anything. And that's something she's not able to do. You're like a planner. Someone is nothing but a drama queen. Very karmic, insecure, always in competition with other people, in competition with an empress energy that she don't even stand a chance against. It's like someone is competing where they don't compare. Like someone has to... Someone has to manipulate the people around them in order to get things from them or to get like assistance or help or love or something like that from them. As an empress, you don't have to do that. You don't have to manipulate. You don't have to throw a temper tantrum. You don't have to do anything silly, funny, like immature. You don't got to do none of that to get what you want from people because you're naturally abundant. Like people love, yeah, people love you naturally. You're naturally abundant. You may be receiving some type of download about what's going on behind the scenes. You're not there. And then, even though you're not there and you know intuitively what's going on with a family, that they're going through an ending, right, for bribing people to interfere with your livelihood, your stability, your energy, and all of that. There is someone in here saying that you're stalking them. Meanwhile, you don't even know who this person is. The, the fact of the matter is maybe they're in your energy. Maybe they're coming around your home. Maybe they're invading your privacy and you're picking up on it. But someone in here thinks that you are stalking them. It's like, see, he wouldn't be mentioning that. She wouldn't be mentioning that if they weren't stalking me. It's like, no, 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 no. You're coming after someone that's gifted. Someone that's like, they know they can pick up on energy and things like that. So if you are constantly in their energy, they know that you are there. They'll pick up, they'll pick up on you. So someone don't got to stalk you. 
They don't got to be physically around you. If you're like, let's say I have a platform, someone clicks on my platform with their negative energy, honey, I just going to know. My ancestors going to tell me, hey, there's a clown on your channel with negative energy. And I'll be there, will you make sure they leave? They are not wanted here. I need them to go on. Okay, I got better things to worry about. Okay? And the ancestors be like, hey, 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 go away. And then when you mention that you know you you know this is going, because that's all with, with, with like high priestesses. All you got to do is in, like, all you got to do is open yourself to their energy. Like whether they're stepping in a room, getting out, clicking on like a platform like mine's. Whether that's you calling them, that's all you have to do for them to pick up on your energy. And they're going to see what it is the, the spirit realm wants them to see. So they don't have to stalk you. But there's a woman out here lying that someone is stalking her, but the truth has been revealed that she's the one stalking you. There could be a masculine saying that you're stalking them as well. You don't know nothing about these people. Lives. You don't know what's going on. But when they come in your energy, you pick up on it and you tell it like it is. They get pissed off. It's like, oh, she's stalking me. He's stalking me. No, 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 honey. You came into their energy with your negativity and their ancestors told them who the heck was watching them. So they thought about it and they said, hey, hey, hey I need them to go away because I got, again, better things to worry about. Okay. Got better things to worry about. So them ancestors be like, shoo, shoo, shoo fly. Don't bother her. Shoe fly, don't bother him. And then they get mad. I told you she was stalking me. I told you he was stalking me. Ain't nobody stalking you. You ain't even worth a wink. <laughs> you ain't worth a wink. We, we don't see you. You see us. We don't see you. Because we ain't looking for you. We ain't looking for you. Okay. Someone is going through some type of ending. I'm telling you, we ain't looking for you. We mind our business, but we intuitively know that you're watching us. You're stalking us. You're doing rituals, sending us energies. Okay? The truth is out about everything you've been doing, all your secrets. Everything is out. It was always meant to come out. That's, that's just silly things about dark workers. They do things from behind the scenes. And if they don't get cut today, they think, oh, we got away with it. No, you did not. You're dumb. To think that way. No, you did not. What, what you do in the dark will always come to the light. That's how it's always meant to be because you're too karmic to put two and two together. These kind of people, they do one, two things. Nothing happens for now. They say, oh, we got away with it. We're good. We're in the clear. We can, we can do it some more. Okay? Yeah, they say we can do it some more. And then it's that one, one, one. Expose. Interrogation. The heck were you doing? What were you doing? You weren't supposed to be there. Why are you there front and center? And now you're burdening and weighed down because you made a stupid decision, right? To temper with someone's life. Talking about they're stalking you. Ain't nobody stalking you. You're stalking and you're, the truth is exposed about everything you've been doing. Uh, everything is out. Why are you so burdened? If, that's some, if the light worker was the one stalking you, they will be the one burdened, but it looks like the group is the one that's burdened. You're burdened. I'm telling you, the group is the one burdened. There's a star seed out there ain't losing no sleep whatsoever about what uh, a false empress has been doing, a fake empress has been doing, what a karmic group. Someone, someone is not missing any Zs. Someone is not missing any sheeps. All the sheeps are accounted for. If ever there's a night that the sheeps are not accounted for, it's because that person chose not to go to bed on time. That's how it is. That's what it is. But someone is focused on closing karmic chapters, balancing their lives and things like that. Someone out there, you may be having some type of closure with the king of swords that's going through some type of ascension. Listen, these masculines are going through some type of ascension. They're seeing things clearly now, starting to ask questions, right? Starting to ask questions. Say, hey, what the heck is this we've been a part of? You mean we've been actually trying to defeat 
the true empress, yeah, this thing trying to defeat you, but it can't. That's why you're moving forward. Make it make sense. If someone was so evil, so wicked, if someone was so, and she came out again, I'm telling you, this is the true empress. That's why this person is so confident because their ancestors are watching over them. Someone's ancestors are very protective of them. That's why every action you all take to destroy this person is a failure and then you end up disappointed. Uh, I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> About the masculines that are going through healing, realizing that they've been coming after the wrong person. Talking about it. You mean we've been coming after the wrong wrong person the whole time? Yeah. There's a king of swords that wants to balance something out with you now because they know the truth. Say a whole group of people have been coming after you. There's a king of cups behind the scenes. I'm telling you. This is someone you used to either date or someone you were acquainted, well acquainted with or someone that feels like they're well acquainted with you and has been causing a lot of manipulations behind the scenes. And this whole group may be fighting this person now because of something they did. Maybe the whole truth is out. Honey, we're going to pull our last car and get out of these people nasty energy. Yeah, they're a nasty energy. This is a whole family, a couple. Living in fear in a community because the truth is out about everything they've been doing to block a union, block a collaboration, block someone from receiving an Ace of Pentacles offer, causing all types of illusions about someone. But whoever they're causing the illusions to sees you for exactly who you are, sees the whole situation for what it is. You will be receiving wish fulfillment. Things will be balanced out in your life. So I, you don't got nothing to worry about. They can keep trying to cause uh, st still miss and stagnation. Whatever is meant to happen will happen in divine timing. There's a masculine behind the scenes going through some type of healing. Um, so, honey, whatever is supposed to happen will happen. Okay? It'll happen. We am about to be in these people. Listen, you, you see me talk. <laughs> let, me, let me pull. Because I don't like things undone. Unfinished. <laughs> I don't like things undone. Clarify this ace of uh, source for me, please, because now that it needs clarity, because we already know the truth. Yeah, honey, we know the truth. The truth. They know the truth. Okay? They know, you know, that he know, that you know, that they know, that you know, that he know, they know, you know. Everybody knows. Everybody knows. Success. Is at the it is it is is in the future of the Empress, the Star Sea. The Star Sea's future is bright. Everybody knows. Now that the truth is out. Everybody knows everything. Everybody knows. Now that the truth is out. Oh, <laughs> Everybody know that the truth is out. That the lamp is out here. <laughs> A discovery has been made, will be made about the truth. <laughs> Ooh. We have the vase. It says your generosity and kindness will result in your wishes being fulfilled. That's why I always say there's nothing wrong with being generous and kind. People that are sick. People that are unstable are the ones that have problems with being kind and generous. Because what they say, I've been kind to people. It don't lead you nowhere. You got to be, you got to be malicious. No, you don't got to be malicious. When you are around the wrong people and giving the wrong people kindness, that's when it backfires. But I promise you, if you are around good people and you're kind to them, they'll always be kind to you. Okay. People that tell you nonsense like that are dark unhealed, broken, and destroyed as heck, and you need to get away from them as far as possible and as quickly as possible, okay? There's nothing wrong with being kind. It's just who you're being kind to and who, what people's intentions are. Miss me with the BS. And these kind of people, when they've been broken down so badly by the world and the people around them, they make it their mission to destroy other people. Now they want to come in and die down your light off your light you know destroy your hope your optimistic attitude and energy you know your loving energy they want to shut all of that down they don't want you being hopeful because what they've been destroyed themselves they said no 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 becky you stay over there 
We're going to stay hopeful over here and focus on our lives, our dreams, our friendships, our healing, being genuine, and what? Our bounty. And you're not going to be taking anything from us. Okay? That's how these kind of dark people work. I wouldn't be nice if I was you. Don't do that. Being nice never pays off. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. What matters is who you're doing it with. Because you can't be nice to people you know are trying to destroy you and you expect something good in return. If you're being nice to someone and you are not sure about it, don't do it. If there's one thing the universe hates, it's uncertain generosity. Like you being nice to people, but you don't really want to be nice to people. You giving something to someone, but you don't really want to give it to them. Don't do that. That's a sin. Okay. So we have one, 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 four. The universe is arranging people and experiences on your path to help you succeed and helping you wake up to who you truly are. I am awakening. Okay. Maybe the nail situation today, my nails is a hot mess that combo. It's okay. We have 99 sums down to what? Nine. Something is almost done or something is done. It is time to get to work on the realization of your soul's mission in life. You have a higher purpose in this life that is yours and only yours to fulfill. Unleash your true power. I am courageous. Mm. That's th- that, that, there, that, there, that there right there came off of that empress that's pretending to be you, darling. <laughs> she said, no, I am the true empress. I am healing. No, you're not. You're karmic as always. You are karmic as always. Your mental is unstable as hell. You're like a clown walking around inside and out. Inner critic. Replace negative self talk. Replace negative self talk. Replace negative self talk with positive affirmations. Okay, collective? Challenge negativity. Okay? Challenge it. He said, have patience. Okay, have patience. Okay, rewards are sweeter when earned through persistence. Good things take time. Oh, baby, and that's my energy. Good things take time. Good thing comes to those who what? Wait. Anyways, thank you for watching the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. I will see you in my next read, and my nails will be done by then. Anyways, See you in the next read. Stay blessed. Goodbye for now.